The tiny antennas in your existing iPhone and Android devices can now get 4G LTE signals from space. Cell phone towers in low Earth orbit. Well, when we think about a cell phone tower, the only reason you need the tower is to get the antennas higher off the ground. Once we're putting it on a satellite in space, that's not really a thing anymore. The next thing is antennas. You need a bunch of antennas to pick up signals from the phones and beam signals back down. The next piece is a piece of electronics called a base station. A base station has a lot of smarts for doing complicated radio frequency communications back and forth to your phone. Interestingly, it's not a router. It's not that smart. All of the networking stuff about connecting your phone calls to the phone service, connecting you to the internet, and giving you an IP address, all of that happens back in a building where there's something called the core network on Earth with fiber optic connections coming in. So all we need is the base station to have a really good link back to that core network on Earth. The last thing is power. The satellites don't need to be plugged into the power grid. They've got big solar panels. So the main thing we need is a good link. Now, normally they'll run a fiber optic link to a tower to give it a really fast connection. But as we saw over here, there's another option. Some towers use microwave links in order to beam an RF signal to the tower's base station to link it to the core network. So what they're doing with the satellites is they're using millimeter wave. The other question is, how do the tiny Tiny antennas in your cell phone manage to communicate with a satellite hundreds of miles up? And the answer is that the smarts are in the satellite. Complicated MIMO antennas, essentially phased array antennas that are combined together to form beams that come down on each phone that they're talking to. So they can focus their power all the way down on your phone. So the little radio on your phone can actually make it all the way into space if there's a good enough antenna in space. But even with all those smart MIMO antennas, by the time the signal beams from space, all the way down to your phone, it's pretty weak because it is going hundreds of miles. So it'll work on a rooftop, it'll work in a field, it'll work on a mountain, it'll work on a ship. But if you go into your house, into a building, you're gonna lose signal. So if you want good service inside your apartment, you're gonna want this kind of setup where there's an antenna pointed at your building. In conclusion, I want you to subscribe for more tech discussions like this one.